Please allow me to see it. Cool. My turn. In. I need to figure out where I'm taking you. You're looking for the security hub nearby. Blueprints show it's a uh, EMP protected by a Faraday cage. So it's not going to work unless you stick JR all the way. Oh my god. <laughs> that did sound kind of dirty.
server room. You should be able to walk right up to the database server now. Well, except for all the alarms, lasers, and guys with guns. Oh, that easy, huh? Thanks. Alright, Ray, send it something your way. Oh yeah, that's definitely something. Yeah, you know, this is gonna take some time to parse. You should be close to a private lift in the CEO's office. My blueprint doesn't show where it goes, which means it's exactly what we're looking for. Damn, will you look at this place? She even got her own private elevator. Going down. Marcus, 
First impressions on the data you sent me. Looks like Titus has the ten-year plan brewing in some kind of prototype lab. All right, let's see what they're keeping in sub-level six. And smash the shit out of it. What Wrench means is find and record evidence that Titus is up to something naughty. Well, if you want to get technical, sure. All right, I'm in a nuclear bunker slash parking garage. You got anything else on the prototype labs? Only that there's one thick ass iron door in your way. No idea what's behind it if you get through. When I get through. Titus Watcher robots have limited offensive capability. We plan to fit them for a much more active role in conflict zones over the next several years. We're currently testing damage resistance within urban suppression contexts. We're also in negotiations with Galilei to build walkers for their space program. Our long-term goals for Titus robots is to construct armor capable of withstanding the strongest ballistic attacks in a combat scenario. In domestic security situations, these new models will easily be able to withstand small projectile attacks, Molotov cocktails, and other improvised riot weaponry. Within the next two years, Titus will begin field testing assault and defense capabilities of our robots for use in both domestic and military situations. Featuring reliable accuracy and superior reflexes, our robots will provide safer alternatives to soldiers or security personnel. People, I've recorded all kinds of ridiculous robotic shit down here. Here, you're not gonna believe it. Anything usable for the video? Titus and Bloom plan to put CTOS functionality into armed robots and use them against civilians. How does that sound? Yeah, all too familiar. What does that mean? Feeding big data through war machines was a wet dream of some of the blue concept grunts when we first were designing the CTOS. I made sure it got the veto back then. That's why you've been so involved with this one. Yeah, yeah, I have my suspicions. And now we've got the proof to burn them. Head on out! Not done here yet. More to see. I'll be in touch. System on the Weapon activated. Guys. Guys, I can't even. Where'd you find? <laughs> oh, I can't even! Oh! Why does he get to play with all the toys?
system online. Alright, I think I got this beast all figured out. Just gotta get it through these security doors. Any ideas? Listen, if you knock out the fire suppression system, the doors should open as a failsafe. I can do that. Function loss. That did it. Heading to the prototype now. We've got a problem. Looks like the door to the backup servers is still closed. I'm on it. Knock the fuck out of the prototype while I work on the door. Counting on you, buddy. 75% function loss. function loss. The 
door is now open. There should be an elevator. You'll need to find your way up to the back of server room on sub-level 3. Who needs elevators? Make sure you smash the shit out of everything. 50% function lost. Function loss. Fifty percent function loss. above my pay grade. Good, good luck. Fuck. Yo, Marcus. Check out all this Titus shit. It is like engineer porn. I mean, machine learning, nanotech, rail guns, rail guns. Yes, yeah, I thought y'all might like that. This was a gift? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, damn, Ray. You're like some kind of greasy, foul-mouthed Santa. Ho, ho, ho. Merry fucking Christmas. Hey, you guys ready? Sitar's about to release the vid. Compared to other Silicon Valley Titans, Titus goes unnoticed. They do not put effort into their public face. They operate behind closed doors, away from prying eyes. Deathsec pride, and what we found should worry you. 
Pettis is using your tax contributions to fund military-capable machines. Today, a combat prototype ran based through their own facility, demonstrating the destruction they can cause. Within the next 10 years, these machines could be deployed on American soil. If you do not exercise your right to protest them now, they will build an army to keep you quiet and compliant. Pettis has partnered with Bloom to grant CTOS access to their machines. Bloom has sold your private information and weaponized it to use against you, should this project continue to be. We will not stand idle while that happens. DeadSec has given you the truth. Do what you will. <laughs> Come on, let's go see what you scored before you get all the pages all stuck together. Hey, I'll catch up with you later. All right, later. We've got all of DedSec dumpster diving through that Galilei intercept. Anything good? Metric a shit tons of good. <laughs> I've already picked out a serious opportunity for us. Turns out, Congressman Thrust's re-election campaign is getting logistical support from Invite. That's weird. And illegal. Right? Why not just give them money? The Invite's got years of collected data. I mean, that shit's worth way more than money. But why back a doofus like Thrust? Dude couldn't tell his ass if someone fucking handed it to him. Well, uh, let's mess him up, break some windows, see what he does. Yeah, create a reaction, might flush him out. Let's announce this. Marcus, you think you can, uh, bitch slap him for us? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I got something for him. I'm gonna go fuck up that big-ass billboard with his dumb face all over it. <laughs> Send a clear message. And I'm gonna hit up his campaign funding. And I am going to... Fuck up his social media, and I am going to fuck up his website, and I am going to fuck up his online ads. I'm going to go for another beer. Your freedom is going to only be protected if democracy thrives. The corporate interests are rigging the elections. Your elections. Jeez. Your favorite social media giant, Invite, knows everything about you. And they're manipulating your feed to tailor your opinion to their interests. They are fooling you into voting for their puppet, Congressman Mark Thrust. Invite wields the single most powerful population control tool ever created. Defend democracy. Help us tear down Invite. Lend us your processing power by downloading our app and together we will expose Congressman Thrust. Join us. We are dead set.
I don't think Deshaun's gonna show up for his Titus tour. What a shame. They invested so much in the presentation. Another one of Bloom's Silicon Valley romances just died. Aw. You can't see it, but I just shed a little tear. Seriously, though? We killed a 10-year investment in probably Bloom's big chance to further tie law enforcement to the CTOS with their... Hey, the what's new with you? Giant spider Going robot tank down police. Pretty soon. I you? refuse to admit that Sounds was a real good. proposal. Totally real, Be sure. I swear. I'm looking right at a giant congressman. He'll know we're after him now. Way to go. I've got a whole team of DedSec members out working on Thrust's other signs. Nice. Meanwhile, I put together a payload to deploy an invite server. Meet me outside invite and I'll fill you in. Sure. See you.
quítate del camino. Nice work on the billboard. We wanted a reaction, we got a reaction. Yeah? We got an email between Thrust and his cronies. He's seriously pissed. He's trying to pass a law against groups with the capability of revealing proprietary directives and actions. That's us. It sure sounds like something Invite would want. It's part of the reason why they're helping Thrust. Mm-hmm. You need to hack into the CEO's office. Oh, Mary Catskill. And... Here's an exploit to open up the back door into the servers. Another USB? I, I could start a damn store with these. Just don't sell that one. <laughs> oh my god, don't get me started on those fucking things. You know, last time I was in here, things didn't go so well. Worst time ever, really. Yeah. Bad memories. They've increased security because of that, by the way. Well, that's just great news. Almost about to get fired, I guess, but I'm trying to make that it. sucks. Five star I met Hunter's parents after the one the poor one. My mind went like, woo! I felt like I was being magnetically drawn. El mejor lugar para conocer a los poderosos. Esas son las pendejadas que quiero saber. Oye, güey, voy subiendo. Ya mero llego. What is happening? Let's close it up. He slipped through. They think I'm gonna stick around for yet another couple of years. Like, yeah. Am I right? I told him. Vamos. I could have sworn. Ejele. Oye. Que carajo. There. That. Wait. What was that?
Phone tapped. We'll record all her conversations. We'll get everything she says. Head over to the server room and install the back door. Way ahead of you. Just a quick reminder to all inviters. Have the project's best interests in mind. Wasting cycles making the products they wanted. Like no sense.
Okay, what's up with this? You seeing what I'm seeing? Looks like... Shit! They're using Bellwether. Damn! That means Bloom is behind all of this. Oh man, they're manipulating people into voting for Thrust. Know what? Should be easy to refactor this to push against Thrust. Ah, that's genius. Do it. Now get the hell out of there. Uh, the whole world's gonna know now. Don't say no problem. This is off my chest. 